A restaurant in East Charlotte was vandalized and broken into overnight, just hours before the business hosted its drag brunch. But the owner tells Queen City News reporter Shakira Speaks nothing was going to stop them from having the event to raise money for a good cause. First thing I said was, um, we really have to still have our drag brunch. Can you guys hurry? Owner of the Artisan's Palette, Krista Choka, and her staff walked into an ugly scene Saturday morning. A nearly smashed front door and broken garage door window. She says it happened late Friday night, just hours before her biggest event of the month. She immediately called authorities with a sense of urgency. They did the report before like the rest of the staff even got here. It was amazing um, because... The most important thing was that we still did this drag brunch. The restaurant's Instagram post says this isn't the first time the business has been vandalized. North Carolina has a looming bill that would prevent drag shows on public properties or in the presence of minors. There were no minors present at this show. So everyone got here. We cleaned up. There was glass everywhere. Um, you know, we, we haven't even looked at the videos yet. So hopefully we caught this whoever. Um, you know, there was a lot of damage. The community still came out to support the brunch and the featured charity Carolina Breast Friends. Choka says the event was important because her mother and her close friend were both diagnosed with the illness. We were able to raise today in the first show $2,000. We, we pushed through this. We had to push through this and we're going to keep doing it. You, you can't stop us. Reporting in Charlotte, Shakir Speaks, Queen City News.